Okay, so we have our picture, we already exported it, we have the file. So now, um, if we want to publish this file, somehow we want our signature to be on it. We created a unique piece of art and we want everyone to know who created it. So for that, first we have to create a signature and there, there are uh, some websites that you can uh, create your signature. Some of them are paid websites, they are more sophisticated, but I'm going to show you a free option. It's very simple and so let's go this signwell.com so you simply type your name Danny Thomas continue and then they're gonna show up bunch of options different options different signatures that you can use you can load more different styles they have a bunch of them so we have more and more <laughs> you know okay let's choose one let's choose this one so then uh, you have to pick up a color right now the default color is black but you have a bunch of options we want it to be white because our pictures are dark so let's go for or probably I don't know yellow now let's, let's do it white so then save and now we want to choose transparent background so then you, we just download it that's it. We have our file here. Most of you ask me how I create those images with the Magical Light painting on a foreground and the Milky Way as a background with the Micro Four Third camera. Well, today I have good news for you because I'm releasing a series of videos where I explain step by step everything I do to create those pictures. Three years of research and experience are compiled on these videos. I talk about gear, planning, settings, shooting, light painting, editing, and post-production for printing. I am also including my raw files for you to practice the editing process and a PDF summary guide, a quick shooting guide, and a guide to explore the Galleta Middle Sculpture Park in the Anza Borrego Desert which includes the GPS coordinates of every sculptor and access to my Google project of the park. Go to the link below or scan the code and take advantage of a special discount price I am offering for a limited period of time. I see you on my course. This is our signature. That we just created so then we go back to Photoshop and let's go back to the original project and we can place a signature before we export the picture so we just um, place the signature as another picture layer we just move it let's put it there and that's too big probably like that we can make it bigger and we have to pick up the moving tool this tool to move it around well right now we're moving a picture so it have to be selected let's put it there that's probably too bright a little bit so we're going to change the opacity a little bit Put probably 75% opacity so it's not going to be that bright so that's it have in mind that if you are going to print this picture some printing houses they might crop a little bit pretty interesting starting that is that they say you know there is a safe zone where 
uh, you want to make sure that nothing inside the safe zone is going to be cropped, but normally they don't crop anything. We place a signature and then we export the file again. In this case, we're going to export a PNG24. Signed. And right now we have our file here. This is our picture with the signature. Oh.